I have no gun. I'm, I'm innocent. I asked to take a lot of test tests and everything. A former Baton Rouge police officer accused of lying wins his appeal to get back his job. Yusef Hamada's lawyer convinced a board that police procedure was violated when his client was denied counsel during a polygraph test. Hamada was fired when investigators say he falsely accused Raheem Howard of shooting at him during a traffic stop. Now, today's vote does not mean that Hamada will be automatically reinstated. Attorneys on both sides say the fight is far from over at this point. And NBC Local 33's Crystal Whitman joins us now with what Raheem Howard's lawyer is saying about this tonight. Crystal. Well, that's right, Dion. We're speaking to attorney Ronald Haley, Raheem Howard's attorney, to see how he feels about this. Sir, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. All right, so first question for you is how do your clients feel about today's decision? Um, his mother uh, and Raheem absolutely devastated. I spoke with both of them before coming here today. Uh, Raheem literally was in tears over the phone with disbelief that uh, a miscarriage of justice he feels has happened and I would tend to agree with him. Well that was my next question for you. Do you think that the board did the right thing with the facts that were presented to them? That's a tough one. I do understand what the police officer's bill of rights says. My question then is how does this happen? How does the chief of police order him to take a polygraph test when he should know mm -hmm. that it could trigger off this technicality. Um, another problem is the reason for him being fired, at least publicly, was watered down. Uh, they want to talk about uh, the accident that have happened and some truths, but let's talk about the facts as the public knows them. Officer Hamaday tried to take Raheem's life twice, once with the bullet, once by putting the false charges of attempted murder of a police officer on him and sending him to jail. That is the reason why he was fired. And that's what we are gonna be fighting for. Wow. All right, sir, and so speaking of fighting for, what happens next at this point? Well, um, they're gonna do an appeal. We'll be watching diligently and hopefully after the appeal is done, um, Officer Hamaday's not allowed back on the streets. Um, He's a compromised officer at this point. You could go to the district attorney's office there in the process now of trying to purge their files of a officer that has been caught in a lie. Um, us, as far as myself and the legal team representing Raheem, we plan on filing lawsuit in this case in the upcoming days. All right, sir, we thank you so much for your time, and we're going to continue to follow this case and have more information on BRProud.com. And, guys, we're going to send it back to you. Crystal Whitman there with attorney Ronald Haley tonight.